All right, so an interesting stylistic clash here. Prevailing wisdom is he's going to try to take his opponent down and get off some of that patented ground and pound. Yes, and once he's on top, he starts to just gain control first. He does not try to rush to the next position because he understands whether or not he's in the guard, half guard, or side control, he can find ways to land big damage. In the side control, he does a really good job of going knee on belly, posturing right. his body all the way to the top, and just coming down with big punches. Boom, once he lands, he goes back and he secures. Right. Then he goes back to find another, another big strike. He does not waste energy just throwing little rabbit punches. Everything has to matter, as you've seen in some of the great ground and pound fighters right. we've ever seen, like Jack Hermanson. Guy that beats you into the bottom of the octagon until you roll over and give up your neck to get submitted. Yeah, nothing pitter-patter about it. No. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. More than five years apart. Some differences in height and reach as well. All right, now for the particulars, we go inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC Heavyweight Division. And now, introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee. All right, Grinfield rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, to back your corners, come out fighting. You ready? All right, you ready? Let's go, right, so the fight is now underway. On one side, you have a fighter who does everything well, taking on a true grappler on the other side. It's going to be interesting to see how long he can keep it up right. I mean, Damian Maya may be the most specialist type of grappler in the UFC. This guy resembles him in a number of ways. Let's see how he manages this fight against a guy that can do just about everything inside the octagon. Good punch lands. with that jab attempt there. Be first, be first. Oh, beautifully placed in time kick there by Lee. Whoa! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, straight right. Nice defense there. Huge block. Evans gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Oh, nice right hand. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. 
just out of range with the straight left hand. Lands a nice straight punch there. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. What do you follow up a great punch like this with? I'm excited to see what happens. Hands high, hands high. Misses again with a right punch. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Big punch lands through the middle. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Turn it around. Let's move that head now. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Lee. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Evans. Ball left hook to the head, it's blocked. <laughs> Trying to establish that jab once again. Effective punch there by Lee. Just misses there with the left. A nice job there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Big kick land. I mean, he's cutting them down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. There's the leg kick. That one checked by Evans. He's throwing every part of himself into these big legs. This fight's gonna be over, DC. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high with his opponent, thought he was going low. And now he's got him hurt very badly. Oh, nice kick right there. Tell the masses how, how good that feels to get kicked like that. Johnny doesn't. <laughs> it doesn't feel good to get kicked like that. Oh, Ooh, blocks the shot. to go. Keep moving. 20 seconds to go in round one. Rashad gets caught with that punch. Final seconds here. By this young man. He does a great job of disguising that technique. And before you know it, boom, he lands. All right, so let us now check out some of the action in that round, DC. There was a whole lot of it, including a stunner upstairs that nearly closed the show. It was a lot of action. It was back and forth action. But the big moment was that big strike to the head that landed, that put him on wobbly legs. And then survival mode, luckily he made it to the end of that round. and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up and using a lot of diverse strikes. How about that chin? Looking to land the right hand, he misses. Pretty well to the left side. Evans gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. Yeah. Relax, relax. Keep your hands. Plus right hand is true. Oh. 
big kick lands. by him there, DC. He has certainly found his range on the field. I mean, when you don't check, you're going to continue to get blasted with kicks. His opponent has not deterred him from keeping on throwing those kicks. Ooh, what a punch. Yeah, left hook found its target. Nice head kick. Body kick is blocked. Try to establish that jab. What a body kick. All right, let's go. Let's get those hands. Just missed with the left there. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Just misses with the straight right. Big ball punch man. Now he gets back to range. Oh, that straight punch knocked his head in the wrong direction. Really putting his opponent on notice. Right hook to the head block. Don't stop, don't stop. Big kick. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great work. That one snuck in. Nice strike. Beautiful leg kick throw. Oh, looked like he might have been in range, but misses with the kick. Over and over, he landed a big body kick. Nice jab by Evans. That is a gutted leg kick. Big roundhouse now, just misses. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Beautiful body kick. Oh, and there's a kick now to the body. That one blocked by Evans. Unable to connect with the right hand there. Right hand upstairs. Body kick now by Lee. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Got to be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. in there. Just missed with the straight left hand. Let's focus. Let's focus now. Well, he's always on the counter attack, but a nice leg kick there by Lee. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. Punches and punches, punches and punches. Let's go. Oh, man, his leg kicks are outstanding, and you saw a great example of that just there. And you see his opponent starting to slow down. He cannot take many of those kicks. And that's the end of round number two. All right, so that's the end of the round. You know the fighter wants to be given the benefit of the doubt, but he is dealing with a nasty cut on the lip that has only gotten progressively worse as the night has gone on, and the doctor's got to protect the fighter. You know he wants to fight on. The fans don't like doctor stoppages, but if they can't nip this cut in the bud, they're going to have no choice but to stop the fight. All right, so a huge five minutes turned in by him there. Good work with those leg kicks. Real good job with the leg kicks. Just really driving his shin into his opponent's thigh. He did a great job of finding an opening to take the full advantage of it. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Keep going again. Do it again. Oh! Oh, boy, what a shot. And he connects there, DC. Great 
job landing that punch. at trying to shut the liver down. Hands up. Back and forth we go! Right hand upstairs! All right, come on. Checks the leg kick. Nice strike. Again, he's looking for that left, it's not there. Ooh, nice slip there to avoid the punch by Evans. Lee going for the head kick. He misses there. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, lands another shot to the body, beautifully placed as he continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Straight punch lands. Look at him drive his shin into the opponent's body with that body kick. Would you look at the size of that bruise on his torso? Nasty. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Big knee to the body. All right, so he lands another jab now, just snapping that thing off, DC. I believe that the jab was lost in mixed martial arts initially, but now it has been found, and it's been found by this young man in this octagon tonight. Nice, sneaky head kick. Oh! Wow, what a kick! it up beautifully. Real quick leg kick. Oh, head kick attempt. Head movement prevents it from landing. Beautiful kick. All right, so there he goes, continuing to land that jab. When they put this highlight together, it's just going to be one head snapping back. It's going to be boxers going back and watch this guy going, wow, this is what a jab is supposed to look like. Big leg kick land. Head kick lands. Another big leg kick land. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. Ooh, what a punch. was blocked. Just out of range with that left hook. And a nice jab there, champ. The jab is a lost part in mixed martial arts. Guys have found it, and they are fighting behind him real well. He's got to be careful dipping his head when he's throwing that jab. Final seconds of round three. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship rounds. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays from that last round. Unbelievable to see these high-level competitors get in each other's face, tuck their chin, fight down on the mouth guard, and just let it all hang out over the course of five minutes. 
All right, next round is underway. You know these are two of the more conditioned fighters on the roster, so cardio is not going to be an issue here. And for some fighters, you know, you can have one of those adrenaline dumps or the cardio abandons you on fight night. Not the case for these two guys. Both look very fresh as we start this next round. Blocks the shot. Lands a knee there. Nice deception there to get that knee to the target. Really good knee. Nice job of driving it right to the target. Getting it to land exactly where you want it to. <laughs> Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Evans. Lee going for the body kick there, but he misses. No setup whatsoever there. Well, he misses with the left punch there. That's a big strike right there. Well, not a huge strike lands there. Somehow, his opponent stayed up with him. I mean, he's still on his feet, but he's not up by much. Evans gets hit by that leg kick. May not be a bad idea to start to check some of these. Oh, nice jab by him there. And I guess on the other side, hard to get your offense going when your head keeps getting snapped back like a Pez dispenser. Every time he tries to go forward and use his own offense, the jab is stopping him in his tracks. He's doing a great job of fighting behind him. Kick to the body by Lee. What a punch. Again, working off that beautiful jab, he continues to keep his opponent at distance. I mean, keeps him at bay with that beautiful, precise jab. It is like a piston. It goes in and out, and before his opponent can even realize what hit him, he's already hitting him with another one. Right. I love, love watching this man fight because of that beautiful, educated jab. Beautiful strike. Big head oh, kick. Oh, good kicks. Absolutely punished by that head kick. He loaded up on that right hand, too. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. You gotta dig deep here. Back to the well with that right hand, it's no good. Oh, beautiful right hook counter. and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. Ooh, big shot lands. Oh, his hands are down. Let's set up that high kick now. Rashad gets touched by that kick to the body. All right, keep Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. I mean, it was perfect. It was absolutely perfect, John. Great placement on that uppercut. Beautiful punch. 
really timing his shots nice. How about those forward. five minutes? All right, so there is the horn at times in that previous round. I didn't think we'd get here after that head kick nearly had him out of there. It was a good round leading up to that. But when you take a head kick like that, when your opponent gets your entire body into that kick, usually the night's over. Very tough to still be standing, but he can't take many more like that. on the right hand. Nice. There's no tell on that leg kick. Let's go. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Oh, man, it ain't Dikembe Matisse. the well with that left hand just out of range. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Connection with the right hand, pretty good punch that one. Nice right punch by this young man. He lands and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. He has to pick up the kick it tonight and it shows. And now he lands a combination. Man, the body work really starting to take its toll here. Obvious redness on that right side. Throwing that jab, no good. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do. Back to the left hand now. Unable to connect. Real sneaky by kick. Rashad gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Oh, and he counters with a straight left. That landed flush. That shot is blocked by Evans. As he gets close, he's out of the kicking range. He'll suddenly he'll change his stance. If you take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Nice connection. Oh, he's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh! 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 
Right hand upstairs. Calm down. Still okay. nice body kick land. Oh, how clean is that jab by Evans? Put your hands up higher. Come on. Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. Right under the elbow, the body kick land. What a fight! All right, let's look back at some of the action, DC. They go the distance tonight, but you gotta think he won over the judges with his striking acumen tonight. Yeah, you got to watch one of the best strikers in the entire UFC. He did everything so well, and in my opinion, he should cruise to a very easy decision. decision is in it resides with Bruce Buff ladies and gentlemen after five rounds we go to the judges scorecards for a decision all three judges score the contest 48 47 for the winner by unanimous decision Bruce the Dragon Lee all right congratulations to him he is your winner by unanimous decision and certainly a dominant performance here tonight yeah, he did a great job of just dictating and controlling all the engagements of this fight. His opponent never really had an opportunity to lead the dance. He did that from start to finish, and he wins a unanimous.